Well, it's been nearly 80 years since Vernon Mitchell stormed the beach in Normandy, France. He was injured days later when an artillery round exploded near him. Today, the North Texas man is being honored with the highest honor of the French government. Photojournalist Mike Kinney was there for the ceremony. I don't it's been a few years. I was 23 years old during the war. It seemed only like yesterday when it happened. And with us today, we have the Vice Consul of France, Mathieu Rouleau. Give us a second to get burned up here on the stage. An initiative from the French government to acknowledge the war heroes from the United States of America who came and helped liberate France during World War II. You landed with your regiment on Omaha Beach near Saint Laurent sur Mer, Normandy, France, on June 7, 1944. You were wounded with a severe leg, leg injury from a nearby exploding German artillery shell. I lost a lot of friends out there. It seemed only like yesterday when it happened. I stand here today, humbled by your bravery. It's really important for us to honor them and by giving them the Légion d'honneur, which is the highest award uh, that we can uh, give in France. It is an immense privilege to add one more medal to your collection and reward you with the Légion of Honor today. Yeah, it's always humbling to think about this. A lot of the soldiers, and he included, were really young when they arrived, and they left everything behind, their country, their family, and had to go through something absolutely terrible. Service is so important in this country and so important to uh, his life. Uh, so it's great to see it recognized and honored. It's wonderful, yeah. Let me feel good, yeah. Now, Mitchell is going to turn 103 in May. His family says he never talked about the war until after they visited Normandy during the 60th anniversary.